I just upgraded from Adobe CS3 Web Premium to Adobe CS5 Web Premium. And since I do most of my work in Dreamweaver, I opened Dreamweaver up first to see what it looked like. I like the look. It's, it's fine. Um, I've already changed some stuff. You can customize your theme, basically. Uh, I just kept it at designer and closed some, some boxes that I don't use. Uh, this is just the general look I use when I was in CS3. There's this new feature that I both love and hate. If I open functions.php, you'll see that there's a list of files. This init.php is referenced here. So it dynamically sees that this is a file that's important to function.piece. So I can go in here and edit it and save it, which is really cool. With that feature, you get this annoying little box. Dynamically related files cannot be discovered because a testing server is not defined. If I close that and close this and reopen functions.php, I get the annoying little box again. If I go to edit and preferences, and I set discover dynamically related files from either automatically or manually to disabled and then I close functions.pg and open it up I lose that pop-up which is great but if I restart Dreamweaver it gets set back to automatically for some reason actually manually see there's the annoying pop-up edit preferences and it's set to manually if I uncheck uncheck enable related files and say OK and close Dreamweaver and then open Dreamweaver and then open functions.php I no longer have the pop-up which is great but then I no, no longer have that cool little feature that shows me a uh, dynamically related file. So that's kind of annoying, and it's the first bug I've noticed in CS5. Hopefully there'll be a fix for it soon. But otherwise, I like the program so far, and as I get into it more, I will report more.